Hey everyone, Andrew here. Today I'm going to show you how to create a small micro interaction for your applications. The basic idea is to create an icon that transitions from one to the other. So I'll be using uh, an icon, sun icon, and I will transition it to the moon icon as shown here. So it's pretty straightforward. You'll need a sketch and you'll need principle for Mac. So I'm back to sketch. I have two artboards here and uh, one for the sun, one for the moon. The icons are pretty straightforward. You have uh, all for the moon, sun and uh, lines to indicate radiance and one perfect circle for the uh, moon and another perfect circle to eclipse the moon so that we have the crescent look. So what you can do is select the artboards, bring it over to principle so after that uh, you could start connecting one to the other so I'm going to create uh, connect the um, moon to the sun and sun to the moon like this so to, uh, it's totally up to you as to how you decide to animate this and uh, what I'm about to show is my style of animating uh, or transitioning the sun to the moon so well, first thing I I'm going to do is paste the artboard over there. We color this to something else so that we have a clear view. Uh, gonna drag the sun below the moon so that we have a better effect when revealing stuff. And I'm gonna start moving these handles or layers under the uh, sun. Oh, sorry, my bad. The moon. So like so. I'm not really precise here, but. Uh, you get the idea so this creates a smooth transition where you know the sun's radiance uh, emits from its circumference uh, beautifully so the last thing you gotta do is copy the clips paste it over here resize it um, it's better if you bring it above the oval, oval but below everything else we color it so that it creates a small mask mm, make sure it's not above the circle oval okay perfect so now I'm gonna bring it back to its previous color and test out the interaction yeah that, that's pretty much it you can by the way uh, extend the animation using the timeline I'm gonna bring it to 50 centiseconds both ways so create some more slower visible transition so there we go pretty smooth if you have any questions regarding any of the steps in this tutorial please feel free to ask it below the, below the comments or you can get, get in touch with me on instagram and um, if you like my videos or want me to create anything in the future Please do subscribe and like and share and really appreciate your support.